Brooke Schuyler Richardson walked into a Warren County courtroom with her parents by her side. They took seats in the gallery. Richardson sat at the defense table with her attorneys. Present before the court is Ms. Richardson, right? Right. The Carlisle teen is scheduled to go on trial next Monday. She faces five felonies, aggravated murder, involuntary manslaughter, endangering children, tampering with evidence, and abuse of a corpse. Investigators say she gave birth to a baby girl last May, caused the newborn's death, then buried her remains in the backyard of the family's home. The defense claims the baby was stillborn. It's my understanding that there have been some plea discussions uh, but there has been no offer that either was extended or is currently extended by the state of Ohio, right? That's correct, Your Honor. Anything else on that issue, Mr. Rickers? No, Your Honor. All right, Ms. Richardson, did you hear all of that? Yes. With no plea deal on the table, both sides acknowledged they're ready to move forward with the trial. We are here today in advance uh, of our jury trial, which is set to begin on Monday. Mr. Knippen, what's our status? Your Honor, the state is prepared to go to trial on Monday. Mr. Rickers, what's our status? The defense is prepared as well, Your Honor. 70 people have been subpoenaed for jury selection, which will begin on Monday. Judge Don Oda previously ruled against a jury view, so jurors will not be allowed to visit Richardson's home. The trial is expected to last at least two weeks. And more than 80 people have been subpoenaed to testify, but that does not mean they'll all be called to the witness stand. The judge did tell both sides that each attorney is responsible for informing their witnesses that they are not allowed to view this trial on any live stream or remote feed. Reporting live in Lebanon tonight, Karen Johnson, WLWT News 5. All right, Karen.